Dude, that wasn't even like perfect, perfect either. What up, what up? We're here with the Baseball Bat Bros, and today, folks, we have a BB Core bat that I'm starting to hear a lot of hype about. The new Easton Alpha ALX. Let's get it. All right, folks, the latest BB Core and the latest one-piece alloy from Easton here, we have the ALX. So compared to like the B5, this is gonna be a much lighter swinging, more controllable bat. We'll give you a full look at the barrel here. Just, you know, solid, good looking bat. We got the navy blue and gray. Uh, a nice flared knob here. We have the squishy knob, uh, feels really great. And then we have the handle, the grip tape that just flares right into it. Kind of like the hype, uh, really seamless transition from the handle to the knob there. Really, really good job by Easton on that. So guys, I have actually heard quite a bit of hype about this one, especially from college guys that are swinging kind of this new lineup of Easton bats. A lot of them are saying like, bro, the ALX is the move. I think that's potentially like a Voodoo One contender. So we're gonna try this out today. And if it's legit guys, we'll throw it on the exit velo tester. So let's get it. All right, folks, let's see what this thing has got. We're out here on a high school baseball field. It's like 330 to most of left and left center, like 340, 350 to center, then 365 to right center. Let's try this thing out guys. See what the hype's about. That's loud, dude. Yeah, it's pretty good barrel. That's so loud. That sounds nothing like the last alpha. Oh my gosh, that's loud. That jumped, man. Feels good. Wow. Right off the bat, seems like a total redesign, guys. Sounds more like a Rawlings than an Easton, honestly. Super loud. Dude, it feels good. Feels good. You know what it sort of feels like? is if the velo, the Rawlings, I swear, the Rawlings velo, if it was a little heavier and like actually had barrel. <laughs> like if the velo was good, if the velo, was good, if the velo was good, we'd be looking at this. Good handle too. Yeah, oh, the handle's amazing, dude. Dude, I like this bat a lot. That was fair. Oh, that was a jam shot. We might have that though. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh that yeah, was the that was down here. I immediately like this better than the B5, for sure, for any hitter. B5's a log, dude. Oh, Ooh. My Ooh. Oh, my Ooh. oh, my gosh. Byron! Byron! <laughs> What's up, Byron? <laughs> I will add, this is pretty typical of like an Easton alloy bat. Uh, the sweet spot is a tiny bit further out uh, towards the hands, it's not great. It actually does fly pretty well. It just rings you up a little bit towards the hands. That'll kind of cut off its sweet spot score a little bit, but it's hot. Dude. Dude. Dude, Easton, really good job with your last couple bats. Dude, that wasn't even like perfect, perfect either. I still have more in the tank. <laughs> oh, <laughs> bottom of the school. All right. Got it. That's tennis court. Bro. Yep. No! Dude, I, I swear, I promise you, that still wasn't even like perfect, perfect. Oh, I'll get it. Dude, I wish the sweet spot was like just an inch further towards the hands. You have to get that barrel pretty extended. Hands. Hands. Bad. What? That went out? I wouldn't lie to you. Wow, dude. I've got like four or five bombs and none of them were even very good barrel. So many swings in this video, but I'm just enjoying swinging this. Dub for the boys. Awesome. All right, I like this bat. Oh, oh my god! Ew. Jeez, bro. <sighs> JT hack. Ooh. 
Got it. All right, good bat. Really good bat. Really good bat. All right, folks, I'm excited about this one. We have exit velo testing with the Easton ALX, the Alpha ALX BB Core, here at PDX Eastside Training on the hit tracks at Chase Field. Haven't hit here yet. Hopefully, we get a few nukes. So, I have high hopes for this bat. We're gonna test it against some of our ringers this year. We have the number three and number one overall ranked bats, the Select Power, and the Voodoo One. We're gonna see what kind of velos we're sitting at here. I think the swing weight's probably gonna fall somewhere in between these two bats on the ALX, so let's start with the Select Power, get a couple barrels, see where we're at, get a couple barrels with the Voodoo One, and then see if the ALX can match them. Here we go. All right, select power. We have nine sweet spot, nine power, four swing weight. I think that's a pretty accurate scale for this guy. A pretty good barrel there. 95.4, 367. 94.7, go ball. Ooh, 382, good poke. Perfect, perfect here. 99.5, there we go. All right, Team Marini Voodoo One, gonna be a light swing in one piece here, and just electric exit velos. Come towards the hands, 96.9, wow. 97.5, good poke. That's our high, I think. Oh, get out ball, 99.7, that's so gone. That's one of my furthest hits ever with BB Core. 413. Get out. Home run. <laughs> what a cheap home run. The ALX has some work to do, boys. Uh, let's see what the ALX can do, folks. I think we can probably get 100 with this. This bat's hot, let's see. Ooh. Oh, dude, I thought that was gonna be way better. Dang it, 94.7. All right, if anything, that was a little bit towards the end here. Come on, don't disappoint me, brother. Good, there we go, 95.9 or 365. Oh, dude, I hammered that 99. Let's go. But we are right on the doorstep. Come on. That was pretty close though. I gotta be honest, the perfect perfect. The swing weight is definitely heavier than the Voodoo One. I would say it's just lighter than the Select Power. We're probably looking at a good five on the swing weight scale for this. 7-3, kind of had to suck the hands in there too. Damn shot, go far ball. 94-3, 376 on the hands, that's pretty good. Uh, one criticism on this bat, if you miss towards the hands at all, it rings you up quite a bit. Um, like the select power, for example, much, much more forgiving on balls towards the hands. The exit velos though stay high, like 94-3 on a bat that buzzed me up pretty good there. So, I mean, the performance is good, it's just gonna hurt your hands down here. Oh, 99.6. All right, so, so far, we are just barely at a nine on the power scale. If we get 100, though, whoo, the sweet spot, I would say, is just barely above the Voodoo One. Definitely not on par with the Select Power. Right now, unless we get 100, 100 plus, or a good 400 footer, we're looking at a seven sweet spot, a nine power, and a five swing weight. So 21 overall, that's a good, a good, good, good bat. Not great, but a good, good, good bat. Pretty dang good, 98-1, man, we are close. We are close, just not quite there. We're gonna give it one more try. I'm trying, guys, I'm rooting for this bat. It freaking whacks the ball. It's not too expensive. It's going to be really durable. I want it to get 100. I don't think it's none of that. Oh, that's as hard as I can hit it. Nope. Dang it, man. We got a 21 overall on the bat row scale. That's a very good bat for $300. 
there's not a ton of bats that are 300 bucks that are 21 so and there it is folks the easton alpha alx i think this is going to be a very popular bat in college baseball good moderate swing weight pretty good sweet spot if anything i would say the sweet spot towards the hands is uh, a little bit weak it, it rings up your hands quite a bit there but it's a good hot bat guys i don't think it's quite going to be top 10 but i mean it's a good top 15 overall bat for 300 dollars you're not going to find a ton of bats with this type of swing weight uh, that performed this well so again i think one of the best things about this bat was just a really smooth taper and that squishy knob made this bat an extremely comfortable bat to swing felt really really good definitely prefer this over the b5 one of the more solid bats from easton again i think you will see this all over college baseball in 2022 so there you have it folks uh, we'll leave a link down in the description where you guys can go check this guy out and if you want to check out our baseball bat bros merch head over to baseballbatbros.com you'll find all our bb core and u-trip rankings over there as well folks peace out